An Oakland police sergeant under attack. She was trapped in her vehicle, staring down the barrel of a gun. Tonight, we're finding out about the lucky break that likely saved her life. Hello and welcome. I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. Our cameras were there as the suspect faced a judge. Night Beats Andre Borba joins us now with the details. Andre, what can you tell us? Well, Veronica Marcus Moss was arrested last week and formally charged today. Document released during his court appearance paint a picture of how drastically wrong the alleged encounter could have gone. The dispatch call from Oakland Police Sergeant Nadia Clark after a patrol crash on the night of July 23rd is chilling. I just got shot at. I was in a car accident. A closer look at the charging documents for this man, Marcus Moss, reveals how lucky Sergeant Clark may have been. He allegedly shouted anti police statements at Clark and fired. There was an expended 9mm casing found at the scene, but according to the documents, Moss's firearm appears to have malfunctioned. He manipulated the firearm and pointed it at Sergeant Clark again before running off. Moss was formally charged in an Alameda County courtroom this morning. His attorney says people shouldn't rush to judgment in this case. It's very important that uh, he is not tried and convicted in the court of public opinion. Moss was captured after an hours long standoff with Stockton police at his mother's home last Thursday. Investigators say they recovered a 9mm in the home, a gun which he shouldn't have had in the first place, thanks to his prior felony convictions for robbery and burglary. Sources tell KPIX 5. Moss's Facebook page under the alias Cassius Jones was filled with anti police statements prior to the shootings in Dallas, but they were scrubbed. The only thing we found on there was this post. Now, Moss will be back in court in September where he is likely to enter a not guilty plea. In the newsroom on the night beat, I'm Andrea Borba.